Hi, everyone. Welcome back to the weekly M1 Finance Brokerage Account Review. This past week was very depressing. The balance on the account is $31,243.91, but the account was down 1.83% or $575.18. Now, this is with me putting in a fairly large deposit this week of a little over $1,000. So, even with that amount going in, it was still down 1.83%. You can get a better view of what happened this past week here. You see the starting value was $30,835.23. I put in cash into this account, $1,002.52, but yet I still had a loss of $593.84. So it's just very disheartening when you're trying your best to put money into an account, but it's still going down and you're just thinking, I could have just put this money in a savings account and I would have had more money in this account than in my savings account than invest in. It's just hard when we're in these treacherous <laughs> times in the market because you just don't see the value. It's really hard to see the value, right? Because everyone loves to say, oh, invest your money, invest your money, you know, the growth on your portfolio is going to help you to retire early. And you're like, okay, it's not, it's not helping. I've, I'm losing money. The Like I have, I've literally have zero gains. I've, I, it's all lost. So right now how the market is behaving, it's not helping me to retire early. It's actually making it worse. So it's just trying to like, uh, I guess, think long term and not get caught up on just all the red because, yeah, that thousand dollars I put in didn't make a difference. All right, let's see where the damage was done. It was actually all the accounts. So SCHD was down 1.63%. Or $217.08. Realty income was down 1.51% or $131.01. VGT was down 2.53% or $181.26. VTI was down 2.04% or $45.83. So just all red, guys. I'm trying again to stay motivated, but it's just oh so annoying all right let's look at the deposits that i just highlighted for the week so a couple different things happened so the first i was paid out on december 12th my schd um, quarterly dividend so this is a dividend for q4 you can see here it was in the amount of 117 dollars and 89 cents and that got me one buy here all went into SCHD. I got 1.50 shares with that dividend payout. So in short, the SCHD quarterly dividend was just reinvested back into SCHD, which is fine. I'm definitely trying to build out that position anyway. Then on December 12th, I deposited $125. I got one buy that all went into SCHD as well. So I got 1.64 shares of SCHD for that 125. And then next up, I got a dividend payout of $32.84. That was from Realty Income. So it got reinvested back into Realty Income and let's see what I got for it. I got one bot. Actually, no, it went in, it went to SCHD. Apologies. So the Realty Income monthly dividend of $32.84 for the month of December, that actually got reinvested into SCHD. So I got 0.43 shares here. And then... <laughs> Let's see the next deposit. Next deposit is on December 15th. I put in $726.80. See, guys, I'm not lying to you. I've been putting in some money. And this deposit got me two buys. So I 
got SCHD, $699.32 went there. So I got 9.18 shares of SCHD. So the majority of the money went there. And then realty income, $27.47 cents went there. So I got 0.42 shares of realty income. And that is all of the activity for the week, which is a lot, but still down. I'm hanging in there. I'm going to hang in there. I just I just want to actually see the results of what everyone keeps raving about with the stock market and how your assets are gonna grow. And I'm like, I I don't know. I'm waiting. I'm I'm I haven't experienced it yet. If stock market so far has just been taking my money, it hasn't I haven't gained anything from it. So we'll see. I don't have any deposits coming up for next week. I think at a bare minimum, I'll try to find at least $25 to deposit into the account. So more to come there when I do next week's update. All right. I know this one was a little bit depressing, but I've just been feeling very annoyed with all of my investment accounts because... Again, when you're working so hard, sacrificing, putting money into these accounts, I don't make, you know, a million dollars or two million dollars a year, right? So to put in every dollar that I put into this account is a true sacrifice. So it just feels like, okay, I'm sacrificing for nothing because I'm not gaining anything. Alrighty, I am done with my venting about the stock market for this week. I will catch you next week. Bye.